shadow of judgment welcome 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 everyone newcomers and all stop shadow of judgment this is for the week of september 6th to the 13th y'all we're gonna see which sign we're doing next we already did fire fire had four cards come out and i figure i'll tell you guys two in this video if you want to look at that but it's like theirs was weird I wasn't expecting that. Alright, we're going to see who we're pulling for next. No, fire signs. We just did you, damn it. Ah, oh, I hate when the car... Like, yeah, that happens so many times, you know. More than you know. Earth signs. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please check your charts. If this resonates with you, good deal. If not, don't worry about it, because it's just a card game after all. It won't affect you if you don't believe in it. Just boop your nose and here we go. Right? Right. So anyway. Oh yeah, if you want a personal reading, my email, Facebook, and Instagram are down below. Feel free to check those out if you wish. Well, you can just email me. You don't have to check anything out if you don't want to. Yeah. But... You can hit me up there for screens on the house. Everything else comes with the price. And I do accept gifts and donations. Well, not gifts, like tips. I don't know where gifts came from. Like, you can't send a gift to anybody. Well, I mean, I don't know. You're, if you can find some really good gifts, that'd be cool. Because I like the little animated things. If you can find one of an animated kitty, that'd be cool. I'd appreciate that. <laughs> All right. So Taurus, you're up first. You got the Page of Swords, Reverse. You got the Six of Swords, Reverse. And you got the Nine of Pentacles, Reverse. So, that's a way to start things out. Like, someone's trying to find a reason to stay with someone who's broke, and someone is snooping really hard on someone who's broke. Or definitely has, like, not-so-good intentions. You know? Like, this person's, like, got their guard up about it, too. And they're acting like they, like, it's almost like they're acting like they're innocent. With that face. Over here, justice card, Libra. Someone's looking for a reason to stay because they think it's the right thing to do or the just thing to do. This bitch who's broke is, is probably you. Um, could also be a Capricorn or a Virgo Taurus. Queen of Pentacles. Like, she went from being broke to being like, you know what? I, I really didn't need anybody after all. I'm just chilling. Just chilling. Just chilling. Like, I actually have more than enough. And I'm not sharing with anybody. I'm gonna live in the mountains forever. <laughs> uh, yeah, this person isn't happy at all. And they're keeping their guard up for some reason. And that's why they're snooping on you, it seems like. Ooh, there's the Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Cups. Let's check that out real quick, because this is quite a book, right? So it ends with the Ace of Pentacles, and then it starts with the Ace of Cups, right? So what we got here is, like, someone's trying to offer their cup, but that comes with some baggage. You know, do you really want to take a cup with baggage? Because it seems like somebody already got out of some shit, and someone's kind of being an idiot about it. Or they're not being very cordial with somebody who isn't waiting. Right, or maybe you just cut it off. There could be a water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, who's probably a bit upset, really selfish, really in their feelings because this relationship didn't work out. Might be somebody new involved with this, and that will make that water sign extremely... That, that, then they will come in your house and kill your kids' pets. All because they want that offer. Or they were hoping for that offer. It's like they only wanted you when they were selfish and thinking they can get you. Or maybe they selfishly broke up, but are now selfishly shocked that, like, you found somebody else. Yeah, you're not going anywhere to this person. It's like, as soon as you start getting your money up, it's like, mmm. Mmm. Yeah, this is definitely unhappiness on this side. Mm. 
Like, you want to stick around, but you feel like it's right to just travel on. And that's what's going to get you your uh, two of cups right here going. Hmm. Taurus, yours is strange for sure. Yas. Hmm. Like, this page is snooping on, like, this very young empress in the Nine of Pentacles reverse. Because they're feeling like they need to guard against something that's got them really unhappy and left them without that happy ending that they were expecting, I guess. Um, this young empress eventually turns into the Queen of Pentacles, which is, like, one step before becoming the empress to me. Um, and she isn't going towards whoever this page is. Um, she's got some sore feelings about it, but she will take her cup. She does want to stay, but, like, she knows the right thing to do is to just vamoose. Why is this person snooping on you? That's the real question. Or what do you, what do they want with you? Something like that. They want to know and say some things. They got things you say. They want to spread some motherfucking, like, what, 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 are they, what are you spying for if you know where the person is? Just go say that shit. They got some truth to say is that, like, I'm ending this shit. I am ending this. I'm cutting it off. Um, unless you got some money? What? Like, that's aimed right at the Queen of Pentacles head, too. That's why she's looking down. It's just like, oh, thanks. Yeah, I'm not doing anything with this now. Um, oh, there, there's that water sign again, all mad and shit. And wondering about the rest of the Seven Pentacles. They gave one away to this Queen of Pentacles down here. And then they got all mad because, like, now they only have seven? Are you, are you kidding me? <laughs> are you serious? Uh, that's... Confusing. It's like that Queen of Pentacles cherishes the one pentacle that was given to her, but then the person was sore. That they only have, like, they still have a majority of their pentacles left. Why are they upset that they were only getting one? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Why would that even fucking matter? I don't know, Taurus. But, um, that's your reading. Whoever that person you're dealing with is, mind you, cross-watchers switch where needed. Uh, <laughs> they're different. They're different. I don't get it. Maybe it's, like, child support or something? That would make sense. But it's like, why would they be mad for giving you a little bit when they still got a lot? I don't understand that shit. Like, you're just holding like, ah, oh, thanks, it's so... At least I got one. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe they see you as the Queen of Pentacles because you got that one from them. One of the two, right? All right, Virgo, it's your turn. We even started out with your card, my love. You feel broke or just disenfranchised or you don't recognize your identity somewhere. And then we got the Page of Cups right here. And he's coming off for a cup. He's being like, da 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 Well, there's a Ten of Pentacles reverse. That's kind of confusing. Uh, no love offered here towards this, uh, lack of closure with the, uh, Ten of Pentacles right here. This person's over here is trying to offer so two cups can be combined. You know. Even though this is lack of closure, they still want to make their way towards the Nine of Pentacles chick. Um, they're not giving her love because they know something. Or they got the right perspective about shit. This person feels like, um... Everything and yeah, lack of closure. Like it's just both of those are lack of closure for me. So this person feels like things aren't complete between the two of you. They want to resurrect things. They want to give you love. Um, you're going about like you're. Hmm. There's justice in this somewhere, and this person might not be taking a leap of faith, Virgo. This is weird. Like, I'm, I'm seriously looking at this like, this is like actually really weird. Like everybody, like you and Taurus already have like insights on certain things. 
but it's like weird. Like, this person wants to come to you, like to come together or some shit, for some reason. It is a very naive offer, though. You know, because it's a page. Like you really, like you really can't expect a page to be giving you much. They got like a cup with a fish in it. No fluid. A fish, which completely defeats the point of like you know. A cup. Who drinks a fish? If it's not blended, it's not drinkable. You know. So like they're they're kind of um. Back ass words, if you will. As far as I can tell. They want to come together, but it's like, it's this lack of closure with them. They feel like um, a cycle isn't ready to end on their part, even though it is ending. Like, there's a lot of lack of closure when it comes to money, too, and they're definitely looking for a reason to stick around. Um, resurrect some shit. Ha try to have the right judgment about things, but there's something they're not taking a leap of faith about. And this Nine of Pentacles chick... She's not offering a cup because she's got the Ace of Swords. She's not trying to uh, offer an apology. She isn't trying to um, start anything new. But she will enlighten you with her sword, bitch. Yes. And there will be justice nice and swift. Could be Libra. They might be swinging out, right? Hmm. What are we going to look at for you? Because all these are like really, really interesting. This, this is a hell of a story. Um, why does this person feel like... Uh, or why does this indivi one individual feel like something isn't complete? Or there's a lack of closure somewhere? Or something to do... Uh, like, I feel like they only want to stick around for money. But it's like, it's not like you have any money to um, give them anyway. But it's like they're paid. So it's like, it's not like they have much anyway. This is a young empress. Um, she's still trying to figure herself out, but she does have an idea about what the fuck's going on here. Okay, so there was a separation between you two. Left, you both feeling left out in the cold, I feel like. Not just one, two. Might even be a financial thing, right? And they're trying to get out of that mentality. That's right, we're asking for one day. But it definitely left the both of you out of the cold, right? Trying to get out of that bad mentality, and it doesn't seem like the wheel is spinning for them, and now they're just all aggroed. They're all in their fields. They will burn the house down to kill the family pets. They'll wait till you're gone, but they're going to do it. Damn it. Ugh. I hate these little fucking candles, because they never burn correctly. I always burn sideways and shit. And then you gotta, like, make a little divot. Divot. There you go. Like, you have to, like, make a little cake, uh, a, a, a fucking gutter for your wax when it comes to these vault, vault bulbs or whatever. Anyway, that's yours, Virgo. I feel like this person just really wants to get with you because they can't get you out of their head or some shit. And it's like, you're just like, no. Um, I'm kind of broke myself. Just because we can come together and make something happen doesn't necessarily mean that, like, that's worth not being broke for, you know? Like, you're definitely trying to step away from that whole idea at the moment. Or someone's trying to come back to do that to you, and you're like, definitely not, you know? I told you you were going to miss my ass when you left. You know, one of those things. <laughs> Alright, Capricorn. I'm sorry, I heard that in my mother's voice. Oh, good old mom. I love her. Well, I don't know if she loves me. We kind of tolerate each other. Because, you know, it's part of, like, society's standards. I don't know. I always think that, like, me and my mom are just two different people. And we should just do well with just, you know... I don't know. Sorry, I'm trying to get this fucking candle. Not too late. I 
Like, I hate these kind of candles. I'm running out of my big Voltas, and those just pour the way they're supposed to, right? This thing is just ridiculous. Ugh, I hate these little candles. I'm gonna get different ones. I am gonna try to make my own candles. I'm getting a bunch of wax together. Feels like a party. Okay, sorry about that, Caps. Ah, uh, patience is a virtue. <laughs> okay, that was kind of a dickish thing to say. I'm sorry. Ooh, you got quite a few coming out. Someone ain't taking a leap of faith. Someone's restricting themselves. Feeling like something's unfair. But they need to make a decision. And that decision involves apologizing for not being somebody's booty. And not trying to, I guess, have the right judgment call or actually resurrect something. I'm not sure. Ah. Uh, I really hope that's just a bite that I got and not like my eczema kicking in. God damn it. That suck. Anyway, this was coming up for you, Capricorn. So let's see what your shadow is for this week. Alrighty. So. Ah, oh, well, there you are. Just all in your shadow. <laughs> that was quick. That was quick. <laughs> Oh god, someone's trying to offer their love to the devil. Do they not understand what that entails? Lots and lots of varieties of monotony. Lots of... <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, this is interesting already, but... Why would someone want to want to make an offer to be in, like, a toxic relationship? Could be Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Uh, maybe he's trying to offer his cup in order to get, like, the devil to let his guard down a little bit. But the dude's still looking like, mmm. Why is there a fish coming out of that cup instead of liquid? His name's Fred. That, that's not the answer. That's not the question I asked you, though. Um, Capricorn, there might be justice involved here with a Libra. This person isn't trying to let things end. And no. You're just, you're, no, no, no. You're, like, whatever... Whatever they were trying to send your way is just not making their way, man. It's just not happening. You're not dealing with it. Or it just doesn't travel that direction for some reason. Oh, Lord. So, what is this, Capricorns? Because you got the tower. Then we got the Queen of Swords over here. And someone's... I'm trying to get some information about this tower. What? Okay. Everyone's confusing. Unfairness. Libra in this once again. We also got the Queen of Swords over here. And a brand new beginning. Capricorns. Everyone's confusing. This one's confusing to me as well. So we got you. With this sort of toxic relationship, or just an unhealthy one between you and the other person. And for some reason, justice comes in, or a lever comes in, and the tower comes down. If it's this pair in this picture, they're co coming out of the tower because there was some unfairness going on, right? Someone wanted to let their guard down, or someone let their guard down in order for something to happen, but it didn't, or some change to come that didn't happen. And now they're, like, looking on information, like, what was this unfairness in this tower all the fuck about? Like, what the fuck is this? Once again, could be Libra. Also, Gemini or Aquarius. We also have Scorpio, predominantly, along with, like, Cancer and Pisces. With this person trying to offer a cup not to let something die. Uh, and I feel like it's because it, it, they don't want to cut it out. They want a new start or whatever, right? They want a new beginning. Hold on, I need to get me some more water to drink. It's like, um... Okay, what the fuck is this tower? What What is this tower? Because it's just like, what is this? Let's see. Someone got their no cuffs knocked over, and it was bad. It just hit like a motherfucker. Secrets were revealed. What? So someone, somebody needs to make a choice... But behind it all, they're still getting the wish fulfilled. Oh, and here's the King of Cups. Cancer, spite. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But he's got, like, his back turned. Acting like he doesn't care. Huh. I'm laying 
a more just because I feel like I need to know because that's important for me like because he's got his back turned for a reason he wasn't happy he wasn't happy and he sure let himself be known about that what is up with this king of cups It's like a Capricorn. Like, did you initiate some justice on two people? So this game cups. Enabling behaviors. He might be looking back on some bad shit he did. And how he probably manifested it. What the fuck? Uh, but there's a new cycle or a cycle just ended for him, right? And there's no offers, and now he's all cranky and shit, like, cut off? Well, I, like, I was getting that with the other ones, too, and it was, def like, the fire signs before you guys. And, like, it kept coming up as the energy of, like, getting cut off to me. Not, like, the, um whole shebang wasn't like good or anything it was just like you know uh, -uh you're cut off at this point you know like there was no more um reason to invest i guess so i'm that's kind of what i'm feeling right now it's like this dude could easily offer something when it came to this new cycle or something should have been offered to him he feels like and it wasn't and now he's like all crabby pants not even trying to look over all of this right here it's like like, I know we're all catalysts for, like, Saturn right now, Caps, because we all are. We're, we're all the ones who are kind of, like, inadvertently or purposely um, inflicting karma all over people since Saturn has been sleeping, you know? Like, building that shit up and then, like, boom, just something happens and everything has just been, you know, crumbling down around folk. Or we've just been seeing it a lot. We've been getting it a lot. Like, Saturn's definitely waking up and the karma's definitely kicking in. And it's like, we're feeling the effects a lot. And this was like, like, whatever is it was like most significant to you that maybe you feel like you weren't able to get over or you didn't want to have to get over. It is, um... It was something that was supposed to happen, I'll say. Like, whatever it is that, like, is bothering you the most right now, about the past, whatever the last situation was, like, I feel like you're not even in that shit, and you're still feeling the energy from it, but it's come down, it's over. Like, it's all done. Like, you don't even need to know anything else about it. It's just done. And, and you being done with it, well, brought the tower. Shwink. So that's the end of the reading, you guys. Thank you for watching my vids. Are you trying, are you looking at me like you're trying to get up here, sir? If you can, like, climb on there, sure. Hold on. You are not getting up on this table, though. But yeah, if you guys like this video, you may like, share, subscribe if that's what you want to do. It's all up to you, really. You're not getting up on the table, sir. I will see you guys later. I have to make sure my cat doesn't get on the table. Love you guys. Bye-bye.